Hi, my name is Layla, and today I'll be showing you how to add QR codes to your yearbook pages. QR codes are custom barcodes that you can add to your yearbook pages so that when your yearbook prints, anyone with a smartphone can scan the code and view whatever URL you'd like them to see. Entourage does offer the option to have you create a custom link page that you can link your QR code to. We'll begin by going to Design, Design Pages. You can add a QR code to an existing page or begin a new page. I'll click View Pages and open a page on the left. There are three different ways that you can add QR codes to your pages. Step one will be to add the QR code by clicking QR code on the left. And now you'll be able to choose between the three different types of QR codes. The three types are video, link page, and custom URL. Video refers to any video that you've already uploaded to the yearbook website. If you haven't uploaded any videos to the yearbook website, you can do so under the Upload tab by clicking Upload, Upload Pages and Other Content, just like uploading a photo. The second option is to select a custom link page. As I mentioned, you can create a custom link page with Entourage. It appears very similarly to your online yearbook store, but instead of parents being able to buy the yearbook, they would actually see the photos or videos that you chose to add to that link page. We also have a help video on how to create link pages. The third option is to have your QR code linked to a custom URL. A popular option there would be to use the URL for your school's homepage. We'll begin by adding a QR code for a video. Once you've uploaded a video to the yearbook website, you'll see a list of all your videos here. Click the video you'd like to link to. And now you can make some choices in regard to your QR code, such as the background color and the color of the bars. You don't have to make changes to that if you don't wish. You can also change the status. If you would like the QR code to turn off or to be expired, you can change that at any time. Active means that it can be used. And if you'd like there to be a specific expiration date for this code, you can do so as well. However, the most popular option is to keep the QR code open in perpetuity by leaving the status as active and the expiration date as blank. Now click Generate QR Code on the left. The QR code will immediately add to your page on the top left corner. Use the hand icon to click and drag and move the QR code where you'd like it to appear. When your page prints, the QR code will also appear just like everything else on the page, so make sure it's not covering up any other content. Now let's add a QR code for a custom link page. Change the type from video to select link page. I've created a link page called Aquarium Trip. Again, we do have a video on how to create custom link pages. Click on the name of the link page you would like to link to and again, click Generate QR Code. The great thing about creating custom link pages is that you can add to these link pages anytime, even after the yearbook goes to print. So this is a wonderful way to ensure that parents and students can access content such as photos and videos that take place even after the yearbook prints. So a few popular options are field day, graduation, prom, and so on. I'll click and drag to move this out of the way. And now let's choose the third type, select custom URL. If you'd like the QR code to go to any other URL, you can enter that URL here. Again, as I mentioned, a popular option is to choose the school's homepage. However, if there's somewhere else on the internet that you would like to link this QR code to, you can do so here. I'm going to put entourageyearbooks.com. That way, when this book prints, anyone who scans that QR code will be taken immediately to entourageyearbooks.com. I'll click Generate QR Code as normal, and again it will generate in the top left. Click Save to save your changes. 
please be on the lookout for more help videos. Thanks for watching.